It is Thursday, um, March 28th. And uh, it's, it's Monday, Thursday. And so I am lucky enough to um, help with the altar guild at church tonight for the Monday, Thursday foot washing service. So I'm looking forward to that. Um, yeah, it's uh, Holy Week. And uh, it's good and Easter on Sunday. Um, first of all, I want to tell you about the winners for the customer showcase. We had four, we didn't have any cat, anything in um, mittens, gloves, and something else. Um, we didn't have anything in that. We didn't have anything in miscellaneous. So there were four categories. So we had four winners. So this in the hat category, the hat and cowl category, this is um, the estuary beanie in Malabrigo Rasta. And um, this was Ophelia Melly. She was the winner of that. Congratulations. Um, in the children's category, this is a wonderful pattern from, um, uh, it's a Millimia. Up. It's a, the pattern is, I'm sorry, uh, the Carlotta dress from the Bright Young Things book from the Millimia catalog from a years ago. This is so cute. This was by Priscilla McLeod. Adorable. That was a winner. Uh, Tina Graves was the big winner in the shawl category. And this masterpiece, and I mean masterpiece, is the Stephen West Fantastitch. I'm telling you, this thing is a blanket. And it is gorgeous. Let me swing it around and hold it out and let you see how fabulous it is. Her colors are amazing. It's huge. You can wrap up in it and never be cold. Unbelievable. So this was Tina. Congratulations to you, Tina. And last but not least in the sweater category, there were many beautiful sweaters, but this one by Diane Weinrich was the winner and it's called Field, I believe. The Fields. So beautiful. Nice yarn choice, had some sheen to it, all that nice yoke front and back. Really beautiful. So congratulations, ladies. All right, now I have to compete with the train. Uh, we got in a new yarn. Let me let it pass. This is the charm of living in Southern Pines. All good. We got in a new yarn from Noro. I haven't had Noro in a while. Uh, but this is beautiful. This is called Compieto, except that sounds Italian and instead it's Japanese. <laughs> um, there are 490 yards on a ball. This is a um, DK weight. It's a striper, but in these gorgeous, the Noro coloring is just always amazing. So this is a beautiful, beautiful pink base, basically. Then we have this beautiful sort of pastel, more of a cream background. This is absolutely gorgeous. Two or three, probably three for a sweater, but absolutely spectacular. This is a purple lavender base. Gorgeous. It is, did I tell you? $56 a ball. It's a lot of yardage. It's almost 500 yards. So which would be like, what, 23, no, 20, $32 a ball. No, that's not right. 20, 23, three and three is six, no, 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 16, $28 a ball. There you go. And blue is the last color. So this is beautiful. It is soft. The content is 35% silk, 35% cotton, and 30% poly. So again, gorgeous 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 think of some beautiful summer shell or tank or short sleeved something lovely it would be beautiful the yarn will do all the work you don't have to do anything but knit purl or crochet perfect all right that's it today um the sun is finally out after two and a half inches of rain. Wow, we got a soaking. I'm sure other people have as well.
I will definitely see you tomorrow.